Hi there, welcome to week six of our Strong Legs series. We're going to start off today with uh, nothing new, just a few exercises that I can do before I go out for a run. So uh, we're going to start with our feet just a little bit apart, bend. We've done this sequence before. So come down, bend the knees, heels are on the ground, lift heels off, push up and down. Just going to cycle through that a few times. You can see I've got visitors again. They've already disgraced themselves once this morning. Heels down, bend, feel that stretch in the calf. Heels up, tall and down. One more time. And into some leg swings. <clears throat> Oops, I'm very inflexible when I start running, especially in the morning. So. If I remember, if I've got time to do a few of these, then it's really helpful and get going straight away. Try and change. You can do it for a little bit longer. You feel a good stretch in the back of the leg, warm up the hamstrings. You can go across the body. Try to extend the upswing. And the other side. Making sure you've got room. Don't kick anything. And finally, just some high knees, either at a little bit of a skip or just standing, just get the knees coming up, standing tall. Okay, shake out. We're going to go into our calf raises. It's our usual sequence, so you want to be about a metre away from the wall. Heels down. We're going to start with both feet together, lifting and lowering. Three, four, five. Heels all the way down to the ground and all the way up onto your toes. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Into single leg. This might feel a, bit, a little bit hard after doing the double leg. Three, four, five, the other leg's just lift off the ground. Seven, eight, nine, just ten to start with and change leg. Heel is all the way up and all the way down. Three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, and we're going to go into a raise of the other leg. Three, four, really open up in the hip. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, we can go a couple more, eleven. 12 and change. 1, 2, bring the knee up high. 3, 4, 5, make sure your heel is coming down. 7, 8, 9, 10. Two more. Well done. Last round, change foot. We're going to come across the body first to one side and then the other. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
12 and change. You can extend a bit further if it's not too intense. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And come down. We're going to take a little shake up. We're going to come onto our step for our heel drops. We'll start off with. Let's just move this a tiny little bit so you can see me. We'll start off with our isometric hold. Toes are on the step. Heels are dropped down off the back. Legs are straight. And we're going to single leg. Nine, ten, let's do two more here. And change leg. One, two, dropping down. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And both together. Fifteen and lowering. So I realise I only did ten then. Couple more. And now we're just with a bent knee, taking gas drop out of the equation. And come down. Okay. Shake out. I'm going to have a sort of mini cardio. First of all, we're going to start off with our skip up. So we lunge down and we drive up. 30 seconds here. Lunge down. Drive up. Use your arms. Over halfway. jog. We're going to go to high knees. We've got a whole minute here. So let's have a medium high for now. Now let's get them a little bit higher. Another five seconds here. Take it down a bit. And then we're going to go up. Three, two, one. Let's get the ring high. The last 15 seconds. Ten now. Keep tall. Three, two, one. Straight into heel flex. So your knees pointing down, and they're about hip width apart, not too close together. Let those heels float up all the way, flexed foot, and let's bring them back even further. Tempo. 
Use your arms as well. Let's keep this tempo up. We have another 10 seconds. Knees pointing down. Come on, heels all the way up. Three, two, one. Into straight legs. So, you to remember not to lean back. Doesn't help. Doesn't work your core. Heels want to come well off the ground. Let's get them a little bit higher. Stay here for another 15. Working your arms as well. Let's pick up the pace. And the height. Come on. This is it for our little cardio burst. 10 seconds. High and fast. where the real work starts. We're going to go into our mountain legs. So we'll start off with our forward lunges. So come straight down. You don't have to take too big a step. That means you can't get your legs at 90 degrees. I think I forgot before. Done that. Bear with me, I'm counting for this. I'll count for the next one. I'm doing 10 each side, so it's about halfway through. Right, one more each side. Now the same again, but with reverse lunges. We'll go for 30 seconds. Get less taxing on the brain. Again, make sure you've measured it so it's just the right length step so you can get your legs in the right position, 90 degrees. Not so you can actually bend that back leg not extended too far away. If you've got a French window or something, you can look in. And time. Okay. So now we're going to do single legs. So reverse, come through. 30 seconds. Halfway. Get the knee nice and high. Do it double whammy. Come down low. Knee up high. Just five seconds here. Keep up the focus. And let's change. Careful not to let the knee go in if you're um, prone to pronating. I am. If you do these exercises and you have got a mirror, and you can make sure your knee doesn't go in. It will help you when you're running not to do it as well. Keeping everything on track. Five seconds. And time. Well done. Okay, into our single legs. I'm going to use my stairs. Make sure you get distance away so you can squat down into that. Shall we go? Let's go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, or we'll change legs. Let's go, one, two. Go, 
it down low. Four, five, legs straight. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done. Right, onto our stairs. I don't know what I've got left today. I think I've seen some hill action this week. We're going to give it a go. We're going to do at least 45, maybe 50. Let's start now. Angle so you can see me. It's going to hurt. It's burning. Three, two, one. Fifty. I'm gonna have to have a little shake out. And we'll go on to our other leg. So set the bar with the first leg. Let's go. Fifty seconds here. If we can make it, I'll count you through. You've done it once, you do it again. Twenty. It's not so bad, is it? Thirty. Come on. It's twenty seconds, we can do it. Three, two, one, and time. Shake those legs out. Got a good bit of lactic there. Okay, we do one more thing, and we're going to use our mat. We do a few glute exercises. We did them before. I think you like them. We're going to do the glute bridge. Leg raise. Okay, so I lower myself gingerly onto my mat. Okay, up into shoulder bridge. Your hips are high. We're going to take the first leg and extend it to 45, parallel with the standing leg. We'll take a few breaths here. Keep those hips high and lower. Change leg. Every time you change, Reposition, lift the hips up, you can manually lift them up, and stand away. A few breaths here. Go down. And down. Reposition, first leg. Up, up, up. And down. Second leg, 45. Lift the hips and down. Back to the first leg. Let's have a breath at 45 and then go up to 90, keeping the hips really high. Hold it there. Higher. Back to 45 and down. Change leg. 45. Up to 90. Lift the hips higher. Really work into the glute of the standing leg. Straighten the leg. Forty-five. And lower. Last one. First leg. Hips up. Forty-five. Ninety. Let's pulse. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Again, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold it. Forty-five. And 
and down. Second back, 45. Know what's coming now. 90. Pulse, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Again, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Hold it. And extend to 45. And down. And come down. Now you can put your right foot on your left knee. And bring this in towards you. Or you can just fold away like this, which is a very nice stretch. And I'll let you do the other side in your own time. Thank you very much. We'll see you next week.